So this video is on getting uh, downloading soil data. So if you are a person who is d using soil data for GIS purposes, that's geographic information uh, systems, then this next video is for you. Um, <clears throat> we are going to click on download soils data. And so what we want to do is make sure we have the right state. So we're uh, on Arizona. We're going to add a county. And it's loading the county. And you can see we've got uh, three different soil surveys that we can download. Um, and they are over here in a zip file. There's the download link. And if I click on that, and I've already clicked it, and I've downloaded it. So I'm going to just jump over to my downloads here real quick and pull it up. This is, oh, you will have to extract it um, because it's a zipped file. Um, but once you've extracted it, this is what you're going to see. Um, if you're using a uh, GIS information, you're going to find all of those shape files in here um, and uh, some more GIS information. If you click on the README file, uh, you're going to get all the what we call metadata or data about the data so you can learn you know when was it collected uh, what kind of file format is it in uh, its version okay uh, and so all, all that kind of information is going to be available to you in this readme file you're also going to find out a bunch of metadata information uh, so someone's written up an abstract about the area so that you get some of that information in here. Very, very, very technical. You're going to get so um, some coordinate information, places that exist in this particular soil survey is all available to you here. Okay, um, and so that's that's what you're going to get when you download soil data. Okay, so I'm going to shut that out and go back here. Um, it's available to you if you're not going to use the data then it's it's not necessarily something that you would need to download okay now in the next video we'll talk about the shopping cart and getting uh, creating a report for your web soil survey